Thank you. How does it feel, though, to be awarded from the National Board of Review? Oh, you know, I'm thrilled. It's very moving for me. Uh, but this is the second time, I have to say. And I got the impression that things like this only happen once in a life. Uh, and the, the, other, the other time was with Women Universe and I couldn't come, so I'm very happy that I can come to, tonight and say thank you for twice. Do you feel you're looking ahead towards the Oscars? Excuse me. Uh, you know, I'm like... Okay. I'm very nervous expecting. You know, this is a too long of waiting, like four months, you know, since you are selected in your own country. Uh, this is happening in October, you know. Then it's like a long, long way. But well, now in just like the few weeks we know. Okay. Thank Good you. luck. Congratulations. Thank you. Philip. Philip, can you just. Phil, can we just get you looking right this way? Trying to save my uh, iris. Philip, can you just right ahead? Just a couple more slides. Right here, Philip. Straight ahead. Right to your mic, please. Philip, Philip. Straight ahead. Straight ahead. Philip, all the way over back there, Philip. Philip, all the way over here. Philip, right here. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hi, good. How does it feel to be honored tonight by the National Board of Review? I would repeat it in the next time. It's, it's very flattering, you know, it's, um, I can't believe it, really, I, uh, I've never really won award for awards for things like this, you know, and uh, so for people to single me out, it's, 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 uh, it's very nice, yeah. Now you worked on with Tom Cruise and Magnolia, and Magnolia's getting a lot of jumping out of it. What do you feel about, you know, you know, you're working with, um, you know, well, so you're I don't know. You know, we are, we are it's great. I've, uh, I've been very uh, blessed with working with very, very nice actors, uh, well known and, and, and not, not well known. And Tom is, is an extraordinarily nice guy, and, and working with him was a pleasure. Uh, and that's, that's just the way it was, you know. So I, I'm, I'm just lucky. Well, have a good night tonight. Congratulations. It has to be very exciting for you tonight to be recognized, especially right in the area where the side story took place. Uh, actually, I'm um, surprised. I haven't written a picture in 20 years. So this is all uh, very odd, to say the least. But the National Board of Review obviously recognizes film. They're the oldest film um, organization, recognizing a body of work. It still yeah. has to you know, be thankful that Oh, I'm, right. listen, I'm always a surprise is always welcome. And that's what this was. All right, terrific. Well, thank you so much. Thank Congratulations. You. And one more last. Oh, 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 what a beautiful couple. Oh my god. Can I just say one thing? Right here. 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 And Lena. Guys, right this way, please. Please stop for one second. Lena, right here, please. Right here, Lena. Right here, Lena. Lena, right here, please. Lena. Lena, right here. Right here, right here. Lena, right this way. Right here, right here. Can you guys look straight here? This way. One more kiss. Right here. To the right, please. No, wait, we can get Looking straight ahead, right here. Straight this way, guys. We didn't get a good thing yet. Lena. One more kiss. One more kiss. <laughs> <laughs> Lena, can I just get you? Yeah, can we have Lena by herself? Right here. Right here, Lena. Lena, right this way. Right here, right this way. Lena. Lena, turn your body all the way over this way. Turn to me. Miss Olin. You're out of cover. Lena, Miss Olin, right this way. Miss Olin. Right here, Lena. Lena, this way. Hi. 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 Hi.
this has to be exciting though for you to be directed, uh, directing, to presenting to John yeah, Irving. It is such an honor to present this award to uh, this very human, human being, John Irving. He's just such a generous man. And what does that mean, the National Border for you? You obviously have been taking too many pictures over here. <laughs> <laughs> Your eyes are a little hairy there. Oh, I think it was the wind. It was so cold. Oh, yeah, it was so like cold. freezing. Oh. Obviously, you Move guys aren't handling New York in this bitter cold very well. <laughs> no. <laughs> To go. <laughs> no, but for the National Board of Review, for John Irving especially, this has to be a big thrill for you. Okay, right it is. Uh, uh, I take. I take pride in this movie. It's been a wonderful collaboration with John Irving throughout the last two years. So it's going to be great to hand it over to him. Hi, how are you? Hi, now obviously what brings you out tonight except honoring great people? Yeah, and my film is getting an award, so I was very excited. I'll walk on the moon. Yeah, yeah. How does it feel to be honored by the National Board of Review? It's pretty Yeah, it really is. I mean, I was so excited first to just get the film made, and then uh, to, to be honored tonight is, is uh, fantastic. So I'm really, really excited. When you first read the book, really kick-started, you know, her career as well. Oh, she's so brilliant in the movie, yeah. Yeah. Not really, no. I mean, I choose things um, that excite me or move me, and I'm, you know, proud to be a part of the legacy that I am. But, but no, that's not a pressure at all. It's a good thing. All right. Well, sure, congratulations. Yeah. Thank you. Hi. It was my life. I was no kidding, 14 years really? old. I was at Woodstock. I was there. Wow, wow. Did you get so you do you go to Catskills as a kid? Yeah. Look at that right here. Look at that right just right. John, right here. 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 John, here. Right here. Right here. Right here. Right here. Right here. Right here. Thank you. And John, one more. Is your wife? Right? <laughs> 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 I'm just, I'm a presenter. I know you're a presenter. It has to be a big honor to be presenting to Tim Robbins for Creative Awards. I mean, what is the National Board of Review? I mean, what, what does that mean? John? I don't know actually who's on the whole National Board of Review. I know some of the people on it, but um, they, don't, they don't really release a list. No, I mean, well, it's nice, honest, you know, it's, it's nice I'm involved in the film. You know, Worked on a film, and I think Tim something he's wanted to do for a long time. So it's always, you know, it's encouraging, especially for projects that are uh, harder to reach uh, wider audiences. So it's uh, every little bit helps. But honored by this um, this group of people as well, you know, um, as, as any other Well, they've seen a lot of the movies. <laughs> I feel like I should ask you, you know, do you want to be a millionaire? <laughs> For some reason, quit a show, millionaire, I don't know. <laughs> Oh, well, 21's on. Maybe I'll go on it. Yeah. Maybe, I, maybe I'll find a good category. All right, thank you. Okay. Hey, John. Hi. Hi, how are you? I'm sorry. We're, we're around here. I started. Okay, I'm sorry you're here. <laughs> for, for, for which award are you? Uh, John Irving. John Irving. Of course. Well, you were with, they were uh, just talking about presenting to you and what a big honor it was. Yes. Um, how does it feel? You actually came down from... Vermont? Was it no, I came from London you today. You came from London today. Right. That's exciting. Yeah, how right. does it feel to be honored by the National Board of Review? Well, I'm very happy. I, I really, uh, I'm happy that the film is getting the kind of attention that uh, I hoped it would. It's been um, uh, 13 years in progress. And I wrote the book almost 20 years ago, or I started the book almost 20 years ago. So it's, uh, it's very gratifying.
It's very gratifying. Do work coming from the National Board of Review mean a little bit more, have a special meaning a as opposed story. to some of the other yeah. short shows that are out there because of how they choose them and how careful they are about their film and their love of film? Um, they, uh, well, I think it's a very classy organization, and I also think that um, it, it's significant because they announce it very early. And um, when you're just releasing a film, that means a great deal. You know, it's not, um, you don't have to wait for it. <laughs> All right, congratulations. Bye. Thank you. Thank you so much. Testing, testing. <laughs> we're, gonna, uh, we're gonna interview Dick. Can we get that interview in there? We wanna get that, come here, we gotta get that interview in. So Dick, how long? Jazz, one more time, right this way. Thank you, step down right here. We have the stage person in the background. One more time. Hi. You've got a big job tonight. Yes. But well, I'm looking forward to it. <laughs> no, a lot of great actors, a lot of great directors. Uh, you know, the National Board of Review has been here a long, long time, longer than anybody else. So I'm very proud to be here. So, you know, are you entertaining the crowd in any particular way? How, you know, this is, uh, we haven't seen you MC too many events. So this is, you know, a pretty big event with everyone here. Yeah, uh, no, I, I, I do it once in a while. I haven't done this one before, but, uh, you know, uh, a lot of the people out in the audience are my friends and peers, so uh, I'm enjoying uh, I'm enjoying How does this award, uh, are these awards, it's really not an award show, different mm. from all the other ones that are out there? Well, I just think uh, this one here is really not about, you know, it's not, should we say, about the hype. It's really about the work. You know, I mean, the, the National Board of Review, like I said, has been here way before. The, it was here before the Oscars. It was here before the New York Film Critics. It was here before all of these award shows. It's really the first. So I think it's something special about it. And the way we do it, it's very kind of like non, not a lot of hype, just more about the real independent feeling of doing, making great movies. Congratulations. Good luck tonight. Okay, thanks. Fun. Thanks very much. Thank you. Alice Boy. Ken Cass. Julianne. Julianne, on this mic. Julianne. Julianne, right here. Julianne, down here, please. Can you come over here, Julianne? Can we get you right here? Julianne, down this mic. Julianne. Can we get you to step back? Julianne, can we get you to step back? and you've got the two Golden Globes. Yeah. I mean, what has this been like for you this year? It's been really, really wonderful. I mean, they're they're all films that I'm very proud of and I really enjoy doing. So it's nice that people, other people are enjoying them too. And even for the Golden Globes, you've got one drama, one comedy. Yeah. I mean, that's got to be a big thrill. Yeah, too. it's great. It's really flattering and, and completely surprising. I mean, I was actually astounded <laughs> when it happened. All right, so the big question is, mm -hmm. what is everybody wearing? You know, what are yeah. you going to wear at the Golden Globes? <laughs> I, I, you know, I'm, I'm not exactly sure. Right now, I mean, I'm, I'm still... I'm still kind of looking, fitting, that kind of stuff. Do you, you know, is it like 
at one time you couldn't get a dress and now everyone's throwing dresses or are you still looking for dresses? <laughs> <laughs> People are really wonderful, I must say. I mean, the designers have been great and everybody's very helpful and, and it's, it's a fun process. How do you feel about winning the ring? It's being honored by the NBR as opposed to some of the other awards. I think they're all great. I mean, you, I don't think it's, I think it's impossible to qualify them. It's just, it's always nice to have your work accomplished, I must say. All right, terrific. Yeah. Congratulations. Thank you very much. Thanks. Hi, Julie. Hi, how are you? Oh, somebody pissed me. There you go. <laughs> Oh, it's a it's a wonderful honor. I mean, it's great. You know, I'm a New Yorker, so it's it's great to get the award here, be able to celebrate with everybody who worked on the movie and everybody else who's doing so well this year. So, thanks. There you go, Sydney, right here. Sydney, can we get a shot? Thank you. How are you doing? Yeah. Oh, there's Julianne Moore. She's very good. I thought you said it was going to be cold. Yeah. Well, we did one more of the two. I didn't get it. Gentlemen, yes. Tim, Susan. Yeah, Can we get the both of you together? Oh, come on. Yes. <laughs> Back to get the both of you together? Yes. Okay. How does it feel to be getting the award? Pretty good. <laughs> Sydney's been a mentor and supporter of mine since I first started making movies, and so it's a great thrill to have him here tonight. And he was also extremely important in the making of the movie, so I'm, yeah, I'm really happy. How does the National Award of Review differ from some of the other awards? I'm not sure I can answer that question, to be honest with you. I mean, it it's, it's, was the first one that we got, and so uh, I'm prejudiced in favor of it because it, it was the most exciting and the first news that we got. I, I don't know that I know the details of all of the precise differences. All right, well, congratulations to both of you anyway. Thank you very much. Sam, 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 both of you at the same please. time, right here. Sam, come right here, please. Oh, it's it's a great honor. I'm very happy that they are doing this film. It's, um, it's, uh, it's a great honor to be here. We can help the ball club. And good Lord willing, things will work out. Well, I'm his day, but since I was here, they figured I might as well give somebody an award, and I'm very happy to be giving Joan her award. It's a wonderful film and a very brave film. Yeah, it makes it very special, um, considering that we're, we, we've been on, under attack from <laughs> certain newspapers. The New York Times has written a couple of things, and the LA Times have written uh, kind of attacks after the movie came out. So I'm, I'm glad that the NBR is uh, ignoring those kinds of things and is acknowledging the film for what it is. And, Giving it its, uh, its due. It's a fight. It's a battle, a constant battle to express yourself. And, uh, and I'm glad there's groups like NBR. Well, enjoy yourself tonight. Thank Congratulations. You. Thank you. Hello, Kim. Hi. Hi. Hi, how are you? I'm fine. Are you okay over here? <laughs> you, all right, so you've got your picture in every ad in the bathing suit. Yeah. <laughs> 
It was warmer. It was much warmer than it is today. <laughs> oh, yeah. How does it feel to be honored by the NBR? Yeah, it's, it's well, lovely. It's such a <laughs> bit of a shock. Hey, hey, you also have a Golden Globe nomination. Mm -hmm. What is that like? I mean, this is really a big year for you. Yeah, it is, isn't it? I, um, is yeah, there any pressure, like you know, even just the dress when you wear the Golden Globes? Not really. I think you have to treat it all like a bit of fun. I think you you have to just enjoy it, because if you don't, then what's the point? So, I'll be wearing a dress. Today, you're lucky I'm not wearing pajamas, I'm so cold. You're just too sensible. No. <laughs> you know, I'm too old. <laughs> well, congratulations. It was great. Thank you very much. Okay. Michael J. Fox today said he's talking back to the show. It's obviously health-related. I didn't you know him. And have any reaction to uh, it's shot in New York? It's another. Yeah, it's sad. Um, Now, we're doing a story on the Indiana Line Are both of you members of the Academy? Now, how does that work? Do you get invited for this from... Right here, please. I have to crack a joke. It's hard to have a smile. No jokes. Mr. Cooper, right back here. I'm right here. I work time back here. I don't know. We're all bunched up here. I guess it doesn't matter anymore. So, you were giving the um, award to Wes. Breakthrough Performance of the Year Award, yeah. Okay, did, they, did he ask you to present his award? Or did they well, that's what I heard. Yeah. yeah. So that must be exciting for you, knowing that. It's a great pleasure. I'm, I'm looking forward to it tonight. Because he's very deserving. Are you surprised that the movie was such a hit, that people really took to it? Well, I thought it could have gone could have gone either way, you know, but uh, obviously I'm pleased for what happened, you know, the turnout. Thank you. Well, I worked with him in Gladiator. I'm very happy to, to be here to give it to him. He's such a wonderful actor. Really wonderful. Now, apparently, um, he's um, nominated for Golden Globe. Oh, really? And we're doing a couple Golden Globe pieces. So, any thoughts or congratulations for him? If you I win? just think he, he ought to win because he's absolutely brilliant in, uh, in the Insider and he's such a wonderful actor. So. Now, you apparently have a big year coming up. What's happening with you? Well, we're starting uh, with Mission to Mars, I think, on the 5th of March, and then Gladiator's coming out after that in May. So, this is a you know, big year coming up for you. Yeah. All right, terrific. Well, good night tonight. Good night. There you go. Michael, right here. And one more spin hit how are you this evening? Very good, very good. This has to be exciting for you. Yes, it is. Yeah. How does it feel to proceed an award like this? Uh, it, it's. We're, it feels great, you know. It was good news, and it's it's, it's, it's appreciated. Uh, there's a lot of issues about freedom of expression that uh, you know that are relevant to the film. It's so yeah. very nice. Are you surprised that the insiders translated so well to film from the true story from you know the real folks? It was it was quite a struggle. I mean, we worked. Uh, you know, Guath and I worked for about a year over a year on the screenplay. Uh, and it was it was uh, it was very challenging to figure out how to make that transition to film to a drama because the the, the, the passion that the passion the drama was there in the real events, but it was oceanic. When you're living it, they just complex about trying to find the, the, the spirit of what happened and turn it into something as small as a two and a half hour drama. It was, uh, it was great work. It was the thrill of it. Did you feel like you almost had another? Watergate 
movie or something that was important that people needed to know or, or you know, the kind of movie that really needs to A little kind of the inverse of Watergate. Where we were we were looking at small things very largely because the issues behind those things were really truly important and very human. And so the, on the surface of it, whether or not Jeffrey Wigand speaks up is important to tobacco, I guess, and the same thing with the full program of CBS. But the, the bigger issues are, to me anyway, are really the, uh, the human values of being low with each other. Great, thank you. Yeah, that's the local news selling. It's a little embarrassing. All right, this has to be a big night for you. Are we all set, folks? I think you have to take one step over. Get close. <laughs> this has to be a big night for the both of you. Very exciting. This is the first award that we've got to award show that we've gotten to come to. So we're just so thrilled to be here. But this has to be. Are you surprised at how the movie broke out? You know, we loved the film so much, but you have no idea if it's going to be able, if it's going to catch on with the audience or not. And the audience response has been so overwhelming, and the critical response and. Now to get this award tonight is just really wonderful. Yeah, I don't want to embarrass you guys. Did you guys get five nominations? Yes, we did. Okay. We did. We got, we got six nominations. We're well, pretty I knew thrilled about, about that, but I've been embarrassing myself all night tonight saying that. No, well, actually, yes, we did, and that's this Sunday, so we're incredibly excited for that, obviously. Yeah. yeah. So how is an award like this different from the Golden Globe? Well, I think because it's voted on by people in, in the U.S. media, and it's such an American film. Um, yeah, I mean, I think it's something, you know, coming from the critics is, there is something special about it, so, and, and the National Board of Review is the first award announced of the season, so for us to get the best picture at the very first award gave us a real sense of, you know, confidence and feeling like people were recognizing the work, which is all you can hope for. We're just thrilled to be here. All right, well, get your dancing shoes on. <laughs> Thanks a lot. Very nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. We'll be, we'll be seeing you again at some of the others. Just, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. So yeah. All right. National Board of Review, which is a very prestigious organization, is still to honor your film as one of the best of this year. It feels great. It, it, it feels very good because you know you work very hard on these. They take like two years. I, it, I wrote it all. I wrote the screenplay also. So you know the time I found. It's based on this novel by Richard Matheson, written in 1958. So, to take it from the time I found the paperback novel in a used bookstore, like two and a half years ago, to tonight when they're saying, "Hey, that turned out well," it feels really good. Congratulations. Thank you. Just have fun with these guys. Thank you. I can't wait now. Tell her to wait two seconds. Hi, what's the matter? John, Feels great. It, it really is a great honor, and um, that movie was really the hardest thing I've ever done in my life. And to be recognized in any way um, is a great encouragement for me to go on uh, to make it more worthwhile. I mean, without it, it's it's already worthwhile, but just to make it more worthwhile. And for the Freedom of Expression Award, um, this is because of this film, you may never go back to your country. Um, I hope that's not the case. <laughs> um, for now, yeah, there is a problem. But do you think it was certainly worth it for this film? Um, the story had to be told, and, and um, I feel it's still worth the while, yes. All right, terrific. Congratulations to you. Thank you. Please. 